Hello everybody and thanks for tuning back in. In, the, in today's episode I want to show you all how effective oil separators are. Um, I have just over 200 miles on my, my startup day oil change from a previous episode and I, I want to show you in a second how much oil just uh, in that little bit of time accumulates in the oil separator. And um, when I show you that, take, take into consideration that without this mod, this oil that I'm going to show you would be sucked through your motor. So let me, let me show you something real fast. See the trip? 235.4 miles. Tap it's my my own element to help separation. Nothing fancy here. Look at that. Two hundred and thirty five miles. So, okay, everybody, give me a minute to take the separator off the vehicle. Uh, I'm going to pour all this oil out, um, run a rag through the inside of there, and reinstall it. Hold on one minute. Okay, everybody, uh, I'm about to show you the oil that comes out of here. Keep in mind, this is 235 miles. Check this out. So there's a little bit of oil left in there. Uh, I'm going to clean the rest out with a rag. But as you can see, it's not just a couple drops of oil that came out of that separator. After 235 miles, this is what, uh, this is what it accumulated. And like I mentioned before, I, I think these mods, these oil separators, I think they're, if you drive a, a car like this, they should be pretty high on your list of things to do. I, I kind of understand, you know, they're expensive. Uh, JLTs is $140. Um, so I, I can see why guys aren't opting for that right off the bat, as you know, as opposed to other more exciting mods. But uh, guys, this is homemade. Works like a charm. Save yourself some money if, you, if you're good with tools and can put things together. I mean, there you go. I have I have absolutely no no doubts that this oil separator that I made will ever fail me. It it just it holds vacuum perfect. I have to put Teflon tape on the lid to make it seal right, but I can live with that. Um, it's a great mod. So I'm gonna cut out now. I'm gonna reinstall it and cut back in. Hold on just a sec. All right, everybody. That's gonna wrap up today's episode. I have my oil separator back installed and ready for use. Like I said before, I, I think this is a very worthwhile mod. It's, it's very simple to hook up. This hose goes to my PCV valve. This hose goes right up to the throttle body. Um, when I made my own, I, I have this mounting system. It's a, it's a picture frame hook bolted to the front stud. And I just have this clamp around that hook and my oil separator and, you know, we're good. It works. I'm happy. As you can see, it's doing a great job. Okay, everybody. Thank you very much for watching. If you like my separator, I have a couple lying around. You can message me. I'm, I'm not trying to get rich from them. Um, otherwise, uh, 
Again, thanks for watching and please subscribe. See you on the next time.